Can he just not hear me? How can I tell him in a way that he'll understand that every second <clears> he remains here, he's electing to kill himself? How can I get him to see what I see? How can I make him look at himself? I suppose I can't. Not in the way I want him to. But I don't make the rules. I simply play to my intended purpose, the same as Stanley. We're not so different, I suppose. I'll try once more to convey all this to him. I'm compelled to. I must. Perhaps, well, maybe this time he'll see. Maybe this time. And I tried again. And Stanley pushed a button. And I tried again. And Stanley pushed a button. And I tried... Stanley had never seen the office this brightly lit. Was it a sign of something? He hoped it was. He hoped very much that it was. Ooh, new content. Oh, new content? What does that mean, new content? Thank you for playing the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. Mm -hmm. As you may know, the Stanley Parable was a video game released in 2013 on home computers. After receiving critical and commercial success, it was expanded upon in 2022 with the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe, a reimagining of the game for consoles and home computers. Okay, yes. The Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe features exciting new content that broadens and expands the world of the Stanley Parable, delighting audiences the world over. Please, step inside and see what thrilling new adventures await in the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. Oh, well, this sounds delightful. I'm very excited to see the thrilling new Ultra Deluxe content. Okay, so far it's an elephant. Nothing special yet, but I'm sure it's just the beginning of a mesmerizing adventure. Mm -hmm. oh. Um, is it broken? What's going on here? Should we... Should we be moving somewhere or... or oh, there we go. All right, finally, at long last, it's on to the new content. I've never been more ready. Let's do it. Hmm. Hmm. I have to say, initial impressions of Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe, mostly tedious. It's as if, um... Oh, okay. Let's see the content. Give me the content, Stanley. All right. All right, let's see. It's... The, the jump, jump circle. circle. That's the only place you could jump. Is, eh. is that it? Surely that's not all the new content. There has to be something else, right? Goodness, another elevator. Stanley, I have to say, initial impressions of this game are not positive. It's just elevators and jumping. Is this what passes for exciting new content? If this is new content, then I could just read you the whole dictionary. There's 20 hours of new content right there. Hell, I could count to 30 trillion. You could put that on the box. The Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe, now with over a thousand hours of new content. And if... Oh, wait. There's more. Very good. Yes. I knew there had to be something else. Let's see it. I'm ready for whatever it is. That's it? <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. You see, Stanley? 
This is what happens when greedy video game developers with no respect for their fan base rush a cheap expansion to market for no reason other than to make an easy dollar. Yeah. And don't get me started on the level of craftsmanship that's gone into it. In fact, I'm looking right now at the game's achievements, and it's hard to believe one of them actually says, Test achievement, please ignore. What quality assurance <laughs> department signed off on this? I'm infuriated and I'm offended, and I, I intend to find these people oh. on Twitter and hold them personally accountable. Oh, it's my fault, Stanley. I built up too much anticipation around the new content, I'm afraid. It could never have lived up to such expectations. If you're still with me, why don't we just reset the game and we'll try to get back to what the Stanley oh. parable is really about? Oh, no. No frills, no gimmicks. Just you and me having oh, no. a great time together like always. Oh, no. What do you say, friend? What choice do I have? It's a picture of the office that we're used to. Okay. St Stanley, come over here Ooh. in the vent. I want to show you something. Oh boy. Okay, you remember how cheap and unsatisfying the new Ultra Deluxe content turned out to be? Well, it got me thinking about the past right. and how much better the Stanley Parable used to be. So I made something special and tucked it away here where the game's developers won't find it. Just our little secret. Take a look. Ooh. Ooh. I call it the memory zone. It's where I've been storing all my favorite memories so I can relive the peak experiences of my life whenever I want. Experiences like the launch of the Stanley Parable on PC. You see, Stanley, doesn't the memory zone remind you of how wonderful Stanley Parable was before it was sullied with a cheap re-release? Remember back in October of 2013, when the game originally launched? Back then, video games had integrity. Mm -hmm. Back then, it all meant something. Oh, the worst. <laughs> Gatlin, Gatlin. We'll just go with Gatlin. Hi, Gatlin. Um, the game is weird but funny. Right now, we're kind of off on a sidetrack here. The narrator seems un unhappy with the game developers. And over here is where I keep reviews of the Stanley Parable. Like this stunning triumph of games journalism. 10 out of 10 from Destructoid.com. Okay. James <laughs> Stephanie Sterling writes, and I quote, Where so many games that aspire to be more than games end up less than any form of art, Stanley Parable strives and then succeeds to be every game ever created. Did you hear that, Stanley? Every game ever created. That's how grand and all-encompassing the original Stanley Parable was. Mm -hmm. It was literally every game ever created. It was Skyrim. It was Persona 3. Does it was all of them. And now... A lot it's, happens. It's no games at all. But also... It isn't even the Stanley Parable Also nothing. Anymore. It's just a husk now. A, lifeless a lot has happened an hour of new elevator content. and nothing has happened it's very existential very uh makes you question reality kind of thing um no monsters yet but I mean, it, it, it really is just you all alone. Here's another moving passage, this time from GameSpot.com. 
Sometimes the narrator is the monster? He did blow me up with a nuclear weapon in one go around. Nine out of ten. Don't you get it, Stanley? The game was perfect. It didn't need anything else. It didn't need. New and now he's angry that the new content sucks. Left alone to spend the rest of time collecting dust in the hallowed hall of beloved video game memories. Oh, these were simpler times, Stanley. But I wouldn't give to go back to have it all over again. I'm just here to be confused Wait, by this game. I don't recall this part of the memory zone before. What's this? What's down here? Well, it's, it's maintenance, my guy. It's maintenance. Oh, no. Oh, God, no. Stanley, it's a collection of reviews from Steam, the online video game distributor. Oh, no. I haven't looked at these in years. Oh, no. I can't even imagine what's being collecting down here. Surely these reviews were glowing as well, weren't they? <laughs> Steam reviews. <laughs> Honestly, I could not be bothered to play oh, this game to full completion. No. The narrator is obnoxious and unfunny, with his humor and dialogue proving to be more irritating Gatlin, than Gatlin, I think you tuned in at the right time. Funny? I'm not trying to be funny. I'm trying to make a serious work of art. I suppose I could write up a handful of gags to insert into the Stanley parable, but the game is already such a densely layered web of profound philosophical insights that I can't even imagine where I'd have the room to stick them. They just straight up stole that generator from Half-Life and left for dead. The dark, dank, depressing steam reviews. Okay, let's see what this one says. While well, the idea for the game is good, for someone who prefers non linear games, this preachiness gets annoying fast. Preachy? Stanley? I'm not preachy, am I? You can tell me if I'm preachy. Honestly, you can. Ah. Oh, goodness. This is actually quite shocking for me. Mm -hmm. I, I always, well, to be honest, I had always thought of the game's dialogue as being rather terse to begin with. You can't know how much fluff I cut from the game to get it to feel as light and airy as it, well, I always thought it did. But maybe it wasn't. Oh, dear. What an awful memory to have to hold on to. These black marks are my otherwise unimpeachable track record. Mm hmm I feel like a failure. Like I let these people down. <laughs> you Perhaps the Stanley point. Parable. If you played this. quite as sterling as I always remembered. What's this one got to say? Do, 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 do. You constantly have to stop doing anything so the narrator can catch up with his long-winded explanations of what's happening. I wish there was a skip button. Oh, no! A skip button? Well, well, yes. Yes, I think we can do that. If I'm truly too preachy, then, then maybe letting you skip ahead for just a moment, surely it couldn't hurt. Not if it means we can strike these negative reviews from the record. Only positive reviews of the Stanley Parable. That's my motto today, and it's what always been my motto. Fuck? I'd do anything for the customer, Stanley. Yes, a skip button we shall have. And here it is. Oh, Go ahead and give Jesus. it a shot. I'll pop you forward in time what? so that the second my incessant droning oh, starts to bore God. you, with just the push of a button, you'll have zipped right past it. It's what the players have been asking for. Oh, you're back, you see? You were only frozen in time for a few minutes, but it was plenty of time for me to deliver a long, rambling monologue full of unnecessary... <laughs> well there, sport. You really did catch me rambling on a bit, didn't you? But that's the power of the button. The minute I start okay. to go off on a thoughtless display of self-absorption, it's right at your fingertips to go <laughs> poof, and it's all over. Oh, I can't wait to see what Cookie 9 will <laughs> Okay, welcome back, Stanley. Now, I should say that the amount of time the button has been skipping through is becoming longer and longer. That last one was, well, I want to say maybe 30, 45 minutes? It's not unendurable by any means, but it's, well, there's really only... <laughs> Stanley! Stanley! St Stanley, please don't push the button again! It's been 12 <laughs> hours! 
You've just been frozen there. He hates it. I don't know why the skips are getting longer, but they're really, truly getting longer. And my God, there's no way out of the room. Oh, Stanley, you're back. You're back. Oh, my goodness. I have someone to talk to again. Stanley, I, I think it's been a week. Or well, two weeks. I've been sitting here all that time. Just sitting here. <clears throat> not a single person to speak with. And mm -hmm. you'd think that that's just how it's always been, right? Mm -hmm. Me talking, and you saying nothing. <laughs> all the, oh, all the no, lights are off! You're here again, look. <laughs> I have had time to think about you and about us and about everything we've been through. I've had the so Kirby much time. Furry. I stopped keeping track. I love Kirby <laughs> Furries. I've Thank you for the follow. Place and not move for one entire year. Let me describe it for you. To begin oh. with, there is only regret. There is only the turning wheel of missed opportunities. I felt nothing at all but regret for the let him ramble times. for a minute or days, months. I lost it all in a blur of the deepest longing to undo <laughs> Oh God, he's gone. <laughs> It's so long, he's gone! <laughs> Hello? Oh, fuck! What have I done? <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> the smoke alarm battery! <laughs> oh, God, we've got to get away from that! But they didn't understand the game was never meant to be funny. It was meant to have a point. It was meant to speak oh. to the human condition. But where are the jokes? Where are the jokes? They bemoaned. Did, they screamed. They I, gnashed their teeth. And did said, I wrap around? Us. It wasn't enough. They had to leave a pathetic what? little thumbs down review and make all of their pitiful demands. But then what? he's talking too much. They said first he didn't. What the fuck? How is he randomly back? <laughs> the end is never the end, 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 is never the end. Oh my. We might be in the Portal 2 timeline now. Ah. Okay. I I hear a dog barking. It's it's real life. I wasn't sure if it was on the game. <laughs> Christ! How many jumps through time are we taking here? How long until the walls collapse and I can get the fuck out of here? It's just gonna keep going, isn't it? I'm gonna have to reset the game to to make this stop. I really do want to know how far it will go. Oh my. Where the hell are we now? Uh oh. All this time. What the fuck? Ooh. 
Jesus Christ. just a barren wasteland of the future. Can I press it again? <laughs> or or is it is it finally dead? Oh. Nope, reloaded the game. Damn, went as far as I could go. Son of a bitch. A soft wind blew outside and perhaps rain started. And if it did, it stopped shortly after. Stanley hoped that he would one day see weather. Oh, I saw some weather. New, new content. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, good. You noticed my sign. Yes, I have something very exciting to show you. Here we go again. Yeah. Oh. 